Harry Potter, but with guns. Imagine waking up, finding guns bolted to your hands, and being forced to fight for your life. Meet Miles. That's every he's day. Anyway. I'll defeat my Miles Morales is the main character? Mm, he's a little too Caucasian to be Miles. What's happening here? What? He's a and being forced to fight for your life. Meet Miles. Wait a second. Anyway. Oh, that's not Morales. Nobody, like why is, why were there Sonic rings? Well, actually, these days, I think most kids want to grow up to be TikTokers. Ugh, terrifying. Did also, people actually go through I want to be a, like a, a star TikToker stage? Or was I always like when I was on TikTok, I wanted to be from TikTok and I wanted to go to YouTube. Did anyone stay want to go on TikTok, post TikToks and be like, yeah, this is what I want to do. Just only TikTok. So like the rest of us, he spends most of his time hopping between the same three apps. What are your favorites? I like Discord, Reddit and YouTube. I can already, I think I can assume how you look based off what you just told me right there. Nigga said Discord and Reddit is his top three? That is insane. I'll be going through, I'll be scrolling through, I'll be jumping between YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram. Yeah, I don't think I use, so I'll be on Discord sometimes to talk to top and voice chats, but that's about it. Miles has the prestigious job of mobile game developer. That's right. You said Twitter. Yes, Twitter's the only reason why I knew about the One Piece live action trailer. Twitter keeps me up to date with things that are happening. That's it. His life's purpose is to help a company funnel money out of parents' pockets. Though, even when he's working, he's goofing off online. <laughs> His favorite pastime is trolling. He's that guy in the comments riling people up. I feel that. that I respect it. Suddenly, I respect it. shot in the face. His coworker, Hadley, has good intentions. He was just trying to warn Miles that his boss, Xander, was looming behind him due to being startled. He accidentally likes his ex's selfie on Instagram. Okay. Name's Nova, by the way. Xander regretfully informs Miles that he's being let go. Damn. Damn, what a jerk. Later on, and at his apartment, Miles stumbles upon Schism, the latest viral sensation to hit the web. What is Schism? What is Schism? Ask? Well, it's basically a live action Call of Duty deathmatch. Oh, so basically it's like uh, the Hunger Games. Or like Darwin game. Who knows about Darwin game? No one? Just me? Okay. Okay. Never mind. I'll... My bad. My bad. Criminals and oddballs are recruited and pitted against each other. Their battles take place across the city and are televised via drones and hijacked cameras. This looks just Miles like Darwin's game. Live streams and starts tippy tapping away at his keyboard. His efforts do not go unanswered, and he's quickly inundated by loving why, and supporting why is he comments doing from this? the schism community. Why it's is not he doing long this? Before he gets the attention of the admin, as we'll soon learn, he's not the kind of guy you want to provoke. He gets Miles' IP. And my boy is shook. <laughs> Just like the good old Call of Duty days, man. Just like the good old COD days. And tosses it away. But his panic is quickly dispelled after receiving boy is shook. He closes the laptop and tosses it away. But what type of... Is he wearing duckies? <laughs> this man's signing up to kill people while wearing ducky underwear. That's hilarious. His panic is quickly dispelled after receiving a text from his ex, Nova. She noticed he was snooping on her Insta, but he takes advantage of the moment and invites her to meet up by the park. Why is she still his profile, his home screen? Y'all saw that, right? Y'all peeped that? That is still his home screen. Her. Nigga's a creep. To his pleasant surprise, she accepts. We cut to them at the park where Nova, a comic book author, draws a temporary tattoo of one of her characters onto his arm. Then she moves in for a kiss. Oh. Miles is rudely awakened from his dream. Oh, but okay, that's fair. Visitors quickly put him back to sleep. Later, Miles' face is rudely awakened from the stream, but the kind Oh, oh, this guy, this guy look like you don't want to mess with him. He looks, oh my God, he's terrifying. Visitors quickly put him back to sleep. Later, Miles fades in and out of consciousness as the schism squad operates on him. He awakens the next morning back What in the, the hell did they Perhaps do to him? that too was a dream. Never mind. They turned my mans into Edward Gunhead. What the fu- Oh. Oh, okay. Wow. Oh. Wow, nice. Malls gets a text officially welcoming him into schism. Oh, and he gets his first opponent, Nyx. Me, he Nyx. has that thing She's stable cute, to his hands? Kicks ass and balls. Cute. And likes to eat salt through her nose. Oh. Whatever. Teach his own, I guess. By the way, this was one of the coolest action scenes I've seen in a while. She claims another victory, continuing to dominate the leaderboards. Okay. We learned from a news broadcast that she was found criminally insane at the age of 13. And you have to be different to be currently insane at 13. What do you what do you have to do? What do you have to do to be criminally insane at 13? Murder? I guess. He recently escaped from a high security prison prior to joining Schism. <sighs> Sounds not so high security. Miles. Schism promises that this is her last one. If she succeeds, they'll totally wipe her criminal record. Nick proceeds to don a disguise. Hey, that looks familiar. 
if you can see this, you're too close. Oh, my bad, bro. My bad. My bad, bro. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I swear I did not mean it. Clear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. With their stealthy new look, Nix heads into a police station and remotely installs a tracker on Miles' phone. Meanwhile, Miles struggles to pee. It's hard enough as it is to keep your stream steady, but when you have guns for hands, it ups the stakes a bit. I mean, it's not that hard. You just take the Glocks and move, move it with your cocks. Like, it's not that bad. Bill got that day with Nova, so he gets dressed as best as he can. Hashtag outfit of the day. All right, let's go. That is... He can't live that like boy. that. Oh, geez. There's Nyx. So cute, but so, so terrifying. Cute. Well, I mean, I, I did see your favorite, your favorite apps earlier. So I guess, I guess it does. I guess it does make sense. I, I, I guess, bro. She blasts her way into the apartment and makes note of his figurine collection. Nice fat cave. With his life on the line. Hey! Hey, what are you pressing figures for? Hey, 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 hey. Listen, bitch. Okay. You are not going to come at me for the things I like and enjoy. Okay. So what if I beat to them? That's none of your business. <laughs> One final request. Shoot around the really rare stuff. Then he manages to pull together a distraction and jumps out the window. He then slides down the stairs and sticks the landing. All the meanwhile, oh. over oh, 300,000 okay. people are already tuned in. Miles flees. Damn, that's like a cousin that stream. <laughs> explaining this is going to be tricky. Things quickly escalate and he has no choice but to run. The cops make chase and one of them corners him before blasting him with a taser. Unfortunately for the cop, this wait, wait, you're telling me he was holding, he was dual wielding actual guns, and they still shot him with the taser? That Caucasian privilege is crazy. That's insane. <laughs> it causes Miles to involuntarily shoot him. He apologizes profusely before dashing out. Nix is still hot on his trail. Finally, we're at the park. Miles quickly spots Nova, but she's already on her way out. No worries, he'll just hop right in. He commands her to drive off, but as she doesn't know what's up, she's just like, take a chill pill, my dude. Kinda hard to do when Nix is pulling up with the bazooka, but okay, I'll try my best. <laughs> he composes himself, and the pair drives off. To the dismay of Richter, the head of Schism, Nix my best. He composes himself, and the pair drives off. To the dismay of Richter. Bro couldn't even unlock his third eye, so he had to draw one. The head of Schism, Nix turns the bazooka onto the drone. After driving off, Miles reveals the severity of his situation to Nova. She responds about as well as you'd expect. He runs off again before finding refuge in a clothesman. We cut to Richter and get a little taste of what kind of man he is when he harnesses oh. his inner Fifty Shades of Grey oh. against an employee. Back to Miles, he slumps out the bin and now has a not-so-fresh pair of jeans. After failing to put them on, he briefly contemplates meeting God. Hey, hey, hobo, you might as well do it. To reconsider. You see, the angle's all wrong. If he shoots himself like that, then he's just gonna blow his face off and be even more sad. <laughs> Meanwhile, Nova seeks the aid of the police, but one of them, Stanton, can't help but laugh as he watches the schism broadcast. Kinda sus. Anyway, they promise to do their best, but after she walks out, Detective DeGraves decides they ought to hack her phone. He's hell-bent on capturing Nix, and this just might be the way to do it. Mm. We then soon consult an evidence board, where we see pictures of a family, a car accident, and Nix. This too- Oh, Nix murked your family? Damn. That means they were a part of the game, which means you need to get good, the fuck? Or it was when she was a criminal. And she had a criminal history. Oh, if that's the case, oh. Mm, that's that's rough, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Two is sus. Back to Miles, we see that the hobo, who's named Glenjamin, has graciously helped them with his pants problem. And he's gay. Homo hobo. Nice. And then even offered him a hot dog, though Miles is vegetarian. In response, Glenjamin passes on some words of wisdom. And it's one thing to say you can't face violence, but when it faces you, you better be ready. I like that. Miles channels his inner animal, then goes to town. After that delicious eight-month-old meal, he thanks Glenjamin. Who How did that convince him to put some nice, long, thin, nice, long, thick meat in his mouth? I don't understand. How does that? How did? How did that get you going? Then offers him a little dessert. You want to smoke some crack? No. <laughs> oh man, I love the homosexual crackhead hobos, man. He heads they to make his my office day. and greets Hadley. Realizing he's likely being tracked, Miles seeks his assistance. Now, if you could just slip your hands down my pocket and retrieve my phone, that'd be great. Yeah, Hadley isn't game for that. Just stick your fingers in there, come on. Oh, now it's a party? Upon scanning the phone, Hadley finds a GPS tracker. He installs an app that will allow Miles to toggle the tracker on and off. That should come mm. in handy. Suddenly, boss man Xander pulls up. 
He digs into his case and again threatens to fire him. Miles storms off, but Xander isn't letting up. Finally, Miles realizes he's a man and takes control of the situation. Xander is reduced to whimpering, beta male, League of Legends player. Damn. Damn. Why do League of Legends players have such a bad rep? I don't understand. Like, like what do they do? Do they just not go outside? Is League of Legends one of those games that they just don't go outside? It's just a joke. Because Miles they apologizes fast. And relief washes over Xander's face before <gasps> Xander's brains wash over his. She's back. Miles takes cover and asks Hadley to cover him. As he runs off, the ever loyal Hadley commits what can only be described as a war crime. What? Mistakes were made. This buys Miles <laughs> enough time to hijack a car, but Nix is hot on his trail. A high speed chase ensues while Hadley enjoys the show during a bathroom break. Nix catches up and somehow ends up on top of his car. How? So is he Spider Man? I hope they don't crash. There's no way you didn't just hit the brake and sling her off the car. Somehow, they survive this, and apparently, Nix is a Terminator. Also, someone busts into Hadley's stall and grabs him. Mid poop, I presume. The chase continues on foot, and Miles heads into an abandoned building. He pops up. I'm not gonna lie, there's no Nix. way Nix has survived her, any of her games. She's, her aim is so bad. ...to give him some tips on how to hold a gun. He returns the favor by shooting her, this time successfully. Some more running takes place while the pair trade shots. He manages to flank her, then fires at a machine, causing it to blow up. Nyx cowers in fear as she relieves a traumatic event from her childhood. Miles spares her life and again runs off. Miles is a bitch. That's the only thing I learned. Miles is a bitch. He tries to hitch a ride, but waving around his gun kind of just scares people off. Whatever, their loss. He whips out his phone and calls Nova. She picks up, and he finally gets a chance to explain to her that the guns are bolted onto him. Oh, okay, so you're not crazy. Suddenly, Nova's attacked, and it's none other than Richter. Oh, nice. He tells him he's nice. got five hours to kill Nix, or else. Miles heads to a junkyard and turns his GPS tracker back on. He calls the cops and tells them that Nix will be at his location within 10 minutes. Ooh. While he waits, he runs into a couple gangs doing business. Understandably, they're a bit sketched out about his guns, and things quickly escalate. As things are about to get deadly for Miles, Nix pulls up with a freaking minigun. Where? What are you? Who's 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 pimping her out? Like, is her is her house just Los Santos? She just she just knows her way around, goes to the right. Like, like what in the GTA nonsense is this? It makes things deadly for everybody. <laughs> Miles gets away and even pulls off. How? His first kill. Then a SWAT team pulls up on him. He's detained, and the two cops from earlier decide that a hospital visit can wait. They still need him to catch Nix, after all. Detective DeGraves reveals to Miles that 16 years ago, he captured Richter. Though, he quickly got out on bail and tracked down his family. While his wife and son perished, he managed to save his daughter, Nix. Whoa, I didn't see that coming. I didn't actually see that coming. How did you see that coming? That didn't make sense. How did you know? Did y'all know? Did y'all see it coming? Nigga, I didn't. Meanwhile, Nova tries to intimidate Richter by mentioning the cops, but he counters, who do you think owns the cops? Back in the car, Stanton has driven the trio to a remote location. DeGraves questions him, but he's quick to respond. Miles is dragged out of the car, but his life is spared. Instead, he's forced to watch a video that Richter recorded, reprimanded. <laughs> Thank you, made in heaven, bro, for the gifted, man. You're giving to all the people who can't afford to watch this 20 minute ad come and go. I'm just kidding. I would never do such a thing to y'all. Come on, chat. Y'all know me better than that. Right, chat? Y'all know me better than that. Thank you for the resub rock and roll, man. Anyways, hold this 30 seconds. Ending him for going to the cops. No, he gives Miles another chance. He now has just 30 minutes to kill Nix. Or Richter's gonna tear Nova apart. Damn. He stands and leaves, and Miles takes note of the detective's bulletproof vest. That did not help much. He then heads to a gaming <laughs> cafe and has a girl help him get into Nova's account so he can find her phone. Wait, I know you. You're the guns and Kimbo guy. Turns out Miles has gone viral. Hey, Miles, look at him! Life. He heads out in search of Nova and finds her along with the schism squad. Oh. Oh, that'd be really bad if that was actually Nova, but I don't think it is. I don't oh, think it no. is, but... Oh, just Hadley. Okay. 
Miles hatches a final plan and flips his GPS so. tracker back on. He waits Nix and then offers a truce. You in? No. <laughs> All the viewers rejoice as Miles finally gets iced. Though, some are sad. Are they beating into the videos? Like, what? what what's happening here? Are they doing a group beat to people killing each other? They've grown to like our quirky protagonist. Nova cries and Richter sends out a cleanup squad. While Miles' body is recovered, we notice his eyes just barely twitch. He's alive. He's transported to the Schism hideout and warmly greets his captors. He then runs into Nick. How did he hit turns them? Out this was the plan. We rewind back to oh, find out nice. what went down. Miles ended up heading back to where her father died and revealed to her that he knew what happened to her family. That's right, Nix. It was Richter all along. He recruited her into Schism after she broke out of prison. Wait, that's stupid. Why didn't they just record that part of the, the conversation? So they, they conveniently edit this part out to make it seem like a, oh my God, he's still alive. I had a piss on that. Because he was afraid of her. He knew she wanted revenge and it was only a matter of time before she learned who was behind the attack. Miles also breaks the grim news. Her dad is dead. And it too was due to Richter. Ooh. After that, she needed no more convincing. Nix helped Miles put on her father's bulletproof vest, and the rest is history, or I guess the future. When was right to the this? Present, that wasn't Miles recorded. What is gamer fuel and storm in? A th they snored <laughs> before they went in. The storm commences as they lay waste to all the henchmen. And yes, the viewers are still tuned in. Richter is in shambles. So, so they just tank the bullets. Henchmen. They're just walking and tanking and bullets. Meanwhile, Nick shoots these guys in their happy spots. Oh, she's aiming for dangling. Walker, should I sub? No, hold these ads. Uh. The pair then find one of the henchmen on a computer, wiping away files. He has something deadly in store for them. A KFC? He has something deadly in store. I mean, SFC? Oh, oh wait, don't copyright me. It's SFC. It's SF. Okay. Um, 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 Saint, Saint Fran San Francisco's chicken. Yes. San Francisco's chicken. Oh, oh, almost. That could have been bad, man. That could have been real, real bad, man. Or for them, a spork. Upon inspecting the computer, we find that Schism has plans to go worldwide. Miles then stares down one of the cameras and speaks directly to the millions watching. You guys are sick, degenerate losers. Damn. Miles laughs at him. Who the hell is this guy? Then we see that even Glenderman is watching. Ha! Put your head more volume. Ha. Uh, I'm telling y'all, bro, the best type of crackheads that are home, uh, homeless are the homosexual ones, man. Look at him with his little ducky, gay duck on his head. Oh, Glenjamin. Beautiful. Effie arrives on the scene and Nix compliments her guns. Then she starts blasting. The pair gets split up when Miles is blasted in the chest and Nix is kicked down a flight of stairs by Dane. Their battle quickly turns gruesome and Nix loses her favorite fingers, if you know what I mean. <laughs> she, sure, sure. To he caught the knife midair on some Naruto type ish. Uh, he just he just caught that thing and threw it right back. Okay, bro. A pump with a stop. Hammer time. At the same time, Miles is trapped by Effie. Though he manages to slip in a sneaky headshot. Back to Nick's. How? Miles is trapped by Effie. How does he let that happen? Oh, he manages to slip. You, as soon as this happened, you should have shot. Sneaky headshot. Back to Nix. Luck strikes when a baggie of her, gamer fuel, falls out. She eats it with her nose and levels up. Now, Dane is no match for her. Nix realigns his chakras, then busts his balls. <gasps> Fine, I'll just blow the both of us up. Hey, what? Damn, of all the times to stop working. Suddenly, Miles arrives to rescue Nix. I think this, this just is promoting drug uses because all it's really telling you is that Drugs give you powers. That's all I'm getting from this. That's Fortunately, they survive. And Thank you, Jax Jin, for the Meanwhile, sub. Victor is making his way to the rooftop with Nova to escape via helicopter. Quick on her feet, Nova scribbles the word roof onto the wall while Richter fires another one of his employees. Oh, Back nice. Back to our dynamic duo, Miles and Nix have perhaps bitten off more than they can chew. With the odds against them, Nix decides to make the ultimate sacrifice. No. Kill Richter for me, will ya? She goes on a death-defying, guns-blazing run before no. blowing herself up. You will be missed, Gamer Oh, Girl. oh Miles wow. finds Nova's markings and makes it to the roof. Millions watch with bated breath as their now-beloved protagonist has beaten the odds. 
So you're telling me millions are watching and not a single one's actively going there to actually join in? I'm, I'm just saying, if there's millions of people watching, there is no way there's not one, two, three, twenty, thirty thousand crazy folks not go going there to like join in and ruin things. I'm just saying, this is BS. And finally, faces the final boss. <laughs> Okay, bit of a rough start, but I've always loved a comeback story. Miles rises and plods forward, eating shot after shot from Richter. How? I guess he turned God mode on. Nova How? comes through How with an assist, up? and Miles pistol whips the slime. What did Nova do? I guess he turned God mode on. Nova comes through with an assist. How the hell did she do that? Miles pistol whips the snot out of Richter. He throws him over the ledge, but he hangs on. Before delivering the final blow, Miles gives him a going away present. That spells the end for our centric villain. The audience celebrates, then Miles bleeds out while a terrified Nova scurries away. Thank you! As the film concludes, we see that Miles has taken on Nix's role of killer badass. Is he still alive? Why is he still alive? Can someone explain to me how he's still alive?